Hello everyone, welcome back to Golden Sun, my name is Dario, and the last part, there's just a lot going on. In the end, the simple goal that we have is to find Babby and figure out what the hell is going on in this this area, so we're going to try to do that. Um, for that though, let me put on my Avoid Synergy. Um, I'm about level 17, um, I kind of wish I was a little bit higher, but I might have to do some grinding off screen at some point. Um, so yeah, we're on the continent of Gondawan here, uh, basically everything, you know, past the sea right there, uh, down south, and there's a lot of area to explore that's currently available for us to explore right now, so I should just get on with it. Um, as you can see, there's a cave right there, I think, and there's also a bridge over here. I don't think it leads anywhere, but we're just going to go take a look. It might just be another one of the... Okay, um, here's the Mercury Gin. Uh, I... I know, I, I know you guys don't believe me when I swear, like, I mean, oh, let's, let's check over here. Like, I, but I swear to you, I, I didn't know there was a Mercury Gin over here. I did notice, though, that Mia had, had one less Gin than everybody else. I totally forgot where the other one was, though. I thought it was going to be an alt filler cave, but it looks like I'm wrong. So, hopefully, if we're able to kill it, which we just did, uh, we just got a new gen for Mia. But see, this is why I mentioned, you know, throughout this playthrough, it's usually worthwhile to explore the the the, the overworld map, especially when you see bridges that appear to lead to nowhere, like right here. Um, so, we just got a new gen for Mia. And yeah, we're gonna heal actually because I don't know how Isaac got hurt so badly. Um, I'll just heal everybody, why not? So I don't think there's anything else to explore over here. Um, I will say it is worth noting that we're unable to, to explore this area west of us here. You see how like there's this whole continent. Like, we can't do anything over there. Um, once again, as far as I know, who knows? Maybe there's, maybe you'll see on Kotaku soon just some like long lost 20 year old Golden Sun secret. You know, how to hit this hidden dialogue option to explore new lands or something. You know, I kind of wish stuff like that happened more often. Like, you know, I don't know. I just, I just love exploring in games. One of my favorite things. That's why I like in games like Breath of the Wild or, uh, you know, just any open world game like Red Dead Redemption 2, you know, just just running around the map and exploring is that's uh, my favorite part. And then when you actually got to play the game, it's like, oh, it's a drag. So something else we're going to do, actually, is if we come over here. OK, I swore I put on that avoid synergy and yet I'm still running into a bunch of enemies. Did I not do it? Maybe I didn't. But anyways. So we're going to come over here to the right, and we're going to, as, as you can see, we're back on the continent of Gondawan, or the continent of Angara, excuse me. Use our new axe that we got, our burning axe. So if we enter Kale Docks from the top, you'll see we can now come to that other side that we weren't able to get to before and get this Venus Gin. Um, in case you might have forgot, this is actually the way most people would get to Tolby. They would take the, the Silk Road north, but due to that earthquake some time ago caused at Mount Vale, there was a landslide we were unable to get through, so... Very clever. It's a very clever way to to get this gin. Most people would probably would just never think of it, um, but it's actually quite simple, simpler than you would think. So if we come back over here, we saw that there was a cave... getting attacked by moles. And that's the assassin blade that we got for Ivan. And somebody leveled up. I missed who it was. Uh, we got for Ivan from the Tolby Spring. So we're in this wickedly wild place with this wild music. An Altmiller Cave. So what I'm going to do actually is I know I'm not going to have a void anymore if I get rid of this. Or if I move the gin accordingly, but I think it'll work out better, hopefully, because these enemies are getting a little bit tough. And we just broke uh, 400 on HP for Isaac. So, 
And uh, in the last part, the the soldiers were talking about trying to find uh, Babby here in this place in Altmiller Cave, and how dangerous it was. They were saying it was just crawling with monsters and other ilk. So prepare for the worst. And, you know, the reason I say wickedly wild, because that music is just kind of like... Like, just like, jeez. Can you, like, scream spooky cave anymore? So, I don't know if you saw, but right before a battle, the screen lit up enough just to show you that the way to the right over here has a bunch of rocks. And it's over here to the left that'll get us through. Um, these shadowed areas are... This is kind of the gimmick of the cave. So, get used to it. Um, it's nothing too hard from what I remember. I think honestly the hardest thing is just gonna be, uh, you know, where my level is currently. I'm not, I'm like level 17. Alright, we just saw, we just ran across a figure actually. Can I run away? Okay, come on. There we go. You... you can see me. Someone's there. Wrapped in syner synergic... Synergic light. Syn Wrapped in synergetic light. Who could it be? You know about synergy, and you can see me. Come on, how come on, mister. Don't hide. Show yourself. Even if I wanted to show myself, as you can see, I cannot move. What do you mean, as you can see? You're invisible! Oh, that's right. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> yeah. You say you can't move. What happened? Mm, yes. I ran out of my draughts and collapsed here. Draught? Exactly what kind of draught is it? You couldn't even begin to comprehend if I tried to tell you. <laughs> you seem to be in a lot of pain. Your life depends on that draught, huh? It does. Could you do me a favor? A favor? What is it? I'd like you to get my draught from me. Get it? Where is it? Deep in this cave. What? Is a pharmacy down there? Witty, aren't we? I'll have to tell you how to find it. Can you do this for me? I don't know, this guy seems like kind of a dick from what we heard, but... I mean, when someone's in need, someone's in need. Are you kidding, Isaac? We haven't actually even seen the guy. He said he couldn't move if, even if he wanted to, right? Someone is in trouble. It's only natural to want to help. I agree with Ivan. Whoever he is, he needs our help. Fine, okay, we should help people in need, is that better? Will you get it for me? What do we have to do to get your draw? First, you'll have to go deep into the cave. You'll find five rocks sticking up out of the ground. Rotate the rocks on the left and right sides. When you turn the rocks in the right order, Five colored lights will appear. Color lights? This sounds weird. Oh my god, Mia, you were just reading my mind. Like, this is an overly complicated, like, hidden wall here. That's right. Lights will appear on the wall. There will be five colors. Blue, green, white, yellow, and red. Turn the five rocks in accordance with those colors. Right. Spin the rocks in accordance with the color of the light. The blue light corresponds with the rock farthest to the left. In order, the other rocks are green, white, yellow, and red. When you see the light, rotate... Okay. Can you slow down? Can I write this down? Like, I didn't realize I was going to get quizzed here. When you see the light, rotate the corresponding rock. So, in order, left to right, the colors are blue, green, white, yellow, and red. 
correctly, if you do this, if you do this correct, a hidden door will open. A door? Somewhere deep in a cave? Who put it there? An ancient civilization long ago since vanished. Oh, please hurry. He seems to be in a lot of pain. You better find that cave, Isaac. Oh boy, oh boy. Can I read this guy's mind? If they don't get that draw, I'll, I'll. <sighs> Wait. The draw is on a table behind the door. Okay. Hopefully this thing isn't too far. But kind of overly complicated. I mean, I guess if you have, like, magic draw that, like, magically heals you, I guess you would hide it too. I don't know. How the hell he found it, though, that's beyond me. But did anyone catch that? I honestly, like, I was more focused on reading than I was trying to remember the pattern. It was a... You know what? I can figure it out. Whatever. Can't be that hard, right? Those, that ancient civilization ain't so tough. They didn't even come up with plumbing. Well, actually, they probably don't even have plumbing in this era right now. Uh, okay, this is the other side. Is there something up here? Don't you hate it when you see treasure chests? You just want to go all the way out of your way to get it. And watch, it's going to be like a freaking like potion or something just not even that useful. See, I knew it. I knew it was just going to be like a vial or something dumb like that. So I guess a fun fact that I'll tell while we're getting to the bottom of this cave is that... So, the whole story about Babby and everything regarding that, I never really knew as a kid. Um, you know, the youngest age I played this was about... Maybe 10 or 11. And... You know, I never used to read a ton of the dialogue except the forced cutscenes that you go through in this game. So, all that information we learned about Babby, the Lighthouse, and Sheba, I never really knew. Um, and it was kind of fascinating for me to see how much of the game there still is for me to discover. And it's, part of it is really why I'm glad I did this playthrough, because I never otherwise would have seen it. And it definitely gives more background to not only the characters here, but also the, the overall story of, of a game that I really have loved and enjoyed. So very cool. Like, I'm like, I was kind of worried because there was a lot of talking. Oh, wow. There's another gen right there. I was kind of worried because there was a lot of talking going on that, you know, I'm going to have to edit and try to condense down to, to be better. But otherwise, a lot of the information we learned was really useful and really valuable. And very fascinating to me although the other issue we're going to come across is here because it looks like we got a little rolling block plus rolling cylinder puzzle again so let's see if i freeze that and push this it should be fine there should just yeah okay so i gotta freeze it now because there should just be enough room for me to to scoot up top and then get that gin. So push this. Oh wait, hold on, hold on. I forgot. If I come around here, push that. There we go, there we go. Aha, nice little brain teaser. Um, we're probably gonna have to fight this, so I'm just gonna save. Alright, two gin in one video. We're on a roll. Actually, three gin in one video. If I did things a little bit quicker, we could have got four in one video. I could have just got the one in, um, the Mars gin in Toldy. Alright, so. Gonna need to do Wish. Oh, wow. Stronger than I thought. And Ivan leveled up, too. So everyone's now level 18. And we'll see what gin this is here. Squall! This isn't Final Fantasy VIII. Alright. Stupid jokes aside, let's get a move on. We got more shadows to run across. 
Oh shit, I didn't heal. Hold on. Um... Shit. Um... Hopefully I can revive her. Come on, come on, come on, work! Yes! Oh! Alright. Do that. Wait, do I have another... I don't think I have another gin that can revive anyone. Defend. Does this one do it? No, we'll just put him to sleep, though. Oh no, I didn't mean to kill him! Alright. Uh, shoot. You know what, I'm just gonna have to get into another battle and then revive him with quartz again. Hope that works. Does that sound like a dumb plan? I don't know. But that's what I get. I totally forgot not to heal him. We're gonna bring you back, Ivan, I promise. Oh yeah, we'll definitely bring you back. We're fighting a fucking rat. Okay, we'll get rid of the rat first that has armor. Come on, work, 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 work. Yep, see. Yep. And there's an instance of the good old gin not working. Alright, so we're gonna set this again. Alright, come on, come on. Uh, actually, defend, defend. Come on, work, 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 work. Yes, okay. I mean, I don't know why I'm being so cheap. I could just use the the water of life, but I don't know. I, I just... I, I like keeping it on hand if I can. Like, I only like using it if, you know, absolutely need be. Which means that I'm probably going to go through this whole playthrough without ever using one. But, whatever. No one's keeping count, I hope. So, 20 bucks that this chest right here is going to be utterly useless. Okay, so... I... Did I lose 20 bucks or... I don't even remember what bet I made. Never mind. Um, we'll give it to Garrett. He has the lowest uh, PP. So I'm just going to run back to the area we were in. Alright. We finally made it to the bottom, it looks like. Although, there's another rolling cylinder puzzle. I was going to say trouble, but it doesn't look like it'll be that hard. Hopefully. Okay, well, I, I kind of skimmed through it really quick, but I learned Revive now, so that'll make things a lot easier when one of them eventually, you know, dies. Uh, however, it's it's another case of if I get rid of two of these Jin, then I won't have Revive anymore. Actually, wait. Okay, yeah, okay. It looks like I need at least a couple. Three? Okay, four, I guess. All right. Glad we figured that out. You know, I guess... I, I, I don't remember if I mentioned this. I I, it w I guess it would be a fun playthrough to, to play through the whole game without Jin. I might do that someday. Um, hard as hell, though. But, you know, people love sadistic challenges, right? Those Nuzlocks that Pokemon has. Uh, what is this, though? Is this a puzzle, or is this just... Ah, oh, it doesn't look like anything. All right. Alright, so we finally made it to the Rolling Rock Plus- nah, Rolling Rock Puzzle. <sighs> Alright, so... Let's start with the left rock. Oh, wait a second, hold on. Let's try Reveal. Uh, do you say do the two outmost ones first? So I'm going to assume that it's going to stop, and then we pick whatever color it shows. Which, if we just use this... No, we fucked up. Okay.
You know, I wonder, like, Babby tells you, like, according to, like, left to right what the rocks mean. You know, telling you because you don't, you know, he's... Or actually, no, we do have synergy. Maybe he just doesn't know about this kind of synergy that you can... You can reveal. Uh... Do I hit blue? Okay. I'm colorblind, so I thought the lat I thought the first color was green. Maybe I hit the wrong one. Oh, maybe I hit white. Which one was green then? Okay, that's pink. Oh wait, green's here, and then this is white. I I don't know. I thought that was pink or something. Yeah, colorblindness has kind of affected me a few times in these playthroughs. Uh, the most being like in uh, the Mario Party playthrough that I did. But. Thankfully, that puzzle wasn't that hard because I just remember, yeah, you can use reveal. Oh my god, just imagine people who play this game and, and was trying to think like left or right, like, oh, which one was it? Oh, it was this one, this one. Oh man, hope nobody had to go through that. So we got the Mystic Draught. Can we drink it? Aw, oh, you bastard. I guess we're too nice. We're too nice of people to do so. Um... You know, it probably would just be a lot easier if I did this, actually. Because he was pretty much on the fl first floor of the, the dungeon. So... I honestly wish I had more to say about Altmiller Cave. Um, I guess another fun fact that I just learned was that the name of it, uh, Altmiller, um, is, is directly kind of related or referencing the... It's, it's like a similar title, like Alamilla, Alamilla Cave in Spain or something like that. So that's one little fun fact about it. But in terms of like gameplay, in terms of like my own experiences, I really don't have a lot of memories regarding this cave. Uh, because you run across so many caves in this game. And th this is like probably the what, the sixth or seventh one that we've run across. Like it kind of just, I don't want to say it starts getting old, but it's just like, it, they just all start to kind of blend together a little bit. And as a result, I really don't have a lot of memories regarding it. It's probably a mimic. Yep. Um, so I just wanted to check what was over there because we didn't do it before. But we got Babby right here, so let's see. You, you came back. Please, the trot quickly. Oh, thank you. You saved my life. Squeak. Look, 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 look. Turning like it's Gatorade. Thank you for your help. I'll be okay now. Look, it's a man! What are you talking about? What did you expect? I, I mean, well, I mean, we couldn't see who we were talking to. My sudden appearance seems to have startled you. Yeah, a little bit. I would have revealed myself sooner, but I could not even move. How did you become paralyzed while you were invisible? And that ability to conceal yourself. Are you an adept? An adept? What are you talking about? You used synergy to conceal yourself, didn't you? Only an adept can do that. Oh, um, yes. I was using synergy to conceal myself. Something in this tale doesn't sound right. I shall peer into his heart. What's the matter, Ivan? This is Babby, the ruler of Tolby. And that wasn't synergy he was using to conceal himself. It was the power of an ancient civilization. I said nothing of the kind. How can you know that? So, I guess that would make you adepts. Does that mean I have finally, finally found true Lemurians? That's what I've been saying. We're adepts. But what's Lemuria? Yes. What is this Lemuria? What? You're adepts, but not Lemurians? So I was wrong. Are you searching for these Lemurians, Batty? 
Abby, you're the ruler of Tolby. You can have anything you want. Why would you want to find these Lemurians? Even the ruler of Tolki has his limitations. Every year I grow older and more frail. This body's had it. And you regret growing older? I understand your desire to remain young. There's nothing anyone can do about it. Wait a sec. Isaac, do you remember what when we were in Soul Sanctum? That's right. Kraden said alchemy could thwart death itself. Death itself. What was that? Did you say you know Kraden? Babby! We've been searching everywhere for you, Babby. The Odom said we will find you in Altmiller Cave. You're not glad we found you? No, it's, it's not that. What are you doing in a cave such as this, my lord? I have my reasons. Everyone in Tolby has been in a panic over your absence. I did not mean to cause anyone undue concern. We're just happy we found you before the finals began. The trials have already ended? Why have you been in this cave for so long? I had an important errand, but it has been taken care of. Splendid, and you can attend the finals. I must speak more with these people. Who are they? I owe my life to them. Pardon our rudeness. You have our gratitude for saving Babby's life. We must have Iodum grant them a reward. You can speak with them again after the, the finals are finished. Oh, I see. If that's what we have to do, then... I have not heard your names yet. I'm Garrett. This is Isaac. I am Ivan. My name is Mia. Come see me at my palace once the finals have ended. I would like to speak with you further. Say, I have an idea. Why don't you enter the finals? You have some interesting powers. But Lord Babby, they have not cleared the trials. Only warriors who clear the trials can appear in the finals. And you don't think saving my life qualifies as a suitable trial? I look forward to seeing you battle. He's asking us to appear in Colosso, isn't he? Is he serious? He wants to see us fight using our synergy. That's what it is. The finals. Should we do it? I mean, we don't really have any time for this. You don't want to either, do you? Either way, we're stuck here in Tolby until Colosso is over. Abby said he wanted to talk to us, didn't he? He seemed to know Kraden. What could be the connection between Lemuria and Adepts? I suspect he knows quite a bit about what's going on with us. I guess all we can do is wait around till Colosso is over. I hate just waiting around. Come on, let's enter Colosso. Can we do it? <sighs> oh, I mean, gotta wait till it's over anyway. Great, it's decided. We'll just have to do our best. If you want to do it, Isaac, we'll go along with you. Well, we got a few answers. Not a lot of them, but I guess it's better than nothing. Um, so in the next part, because, I mean, this part has gone on for quite a bit, uh, we're going to head back to Tolby and presumably enter Colosso. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you then. Take care.